Hi and welcome back to the channel. Thank you so much for clicking into this video. So in this video, I am going to teach you how you can fix 5M has tab responding error on your device. So make sure that you stay until the very end of this video so you won't miss an important step or information that I am going to show you and tell you. So let's get on it. The first fix is to disable security programs. So here mainly shows how you can disable Windows Firewall and Windows and Windows Defender on Windows 10. So first you need to press the Windows plus X simultaneously on your keyboard and then just choose the settings option from the menu and after that click on to the update and security setting on the settings window and then in the in there just choose the windows defender option at the left side of your screen as shown here in this picture and then next click on to the open windows defender security center button on the right side and once inside the windows defender security center window just click the virus and threat protection option so here's the virus and threat protection and then next, what you can do is just scroll down the window until you see the virus and threat protection settings option and just click onto it. So just right here, right here show, as shown in the picture. And then you can go ahead and turn off the options, real-time protection, and the cloud-based protection. So this is the button for the real-time protection and this is for the cloud-based protection. So you can go ahead and turn both of this. And then you can continue to disable Windows Firewall and then just click the Firewall and Network Protection icon on the left on the left side of the Windows Defender Security Center window. And then lastly, you can click the type of network followed by the word active and turn off Windows Firewall. So you can go ahead and turn this off as on in this picture. And now Windows Firewall and Windows Defender have been turned off and you can try launching 5M again. And if the failure happens again, it seems that the interference of the security programs is not the real cause. So enable, repeat the above steps to enable Windows Firewall and Windows Defender and move to the following solutions. And which is the next solution is to verify integrity of the game files. So now, the, verify the integrity of the GTAV game files to see if there are no corrupt or missing game files. So they verify the integrity of the game files. Please perform these steps below. So first, you need to go to your game installation folder and then just scroll down the folder to find the GTAV launcher.exe file. So just go ahead and find this fi the file that is named as this and then just you can right click the file and then choose create shortcut option. And once the shortcut is created, right click it and choose the properties option and on the file properties window, modify the address next to the target as verify. So with space at the end of the address and after that just click the apply button to save the modification and then just double click the shortcut and you will see the shortcut is opened in verification code so the mode will verify all of the game files and make sure that no game files have been damaged or dis misplaced and when the verification ends launch the game through the gta v.exe and wait till the game loads to the main menu and once the once in the main menu, just close the game and attempt to open the 5M. So, that's it for the second fix. So, remember, you can always pause this video and... Or you can always pause this video and follow the steps at your own time. And then next, what you can do is delete the temporary files. So the third solution to 5M not launching is to remove the temporary files. So here's how you can do that. First, you just need to press the Windows plus R key simultaneously on your keyboard. And then just type this percent, local app data percent, in the run dialog box. And then just hit the enter key. You can navigate to the path right here. 5m slash 5m application data slash cache and you can find the folder called 
archive right here and you can delete it and after doing that you can restart your computer and once your system reboots see if the issue persists and then next what you can do is to copy the 5m.exe file to the gta folder so lo lots of users solve 5m not launching after copying copying 5m.exe file to the GTA folder. So this works because 5m requires some modules and libraries that, that exist in the GTA directory. So give the fix a try. And then lastly, what you can do is to disable the integra integrated GPU. So if the um, solutions that I mentioned or I presented cannot help you or did not help you or did not fix the problem, your computer has two GPUs. So please disable the integrated one. So here's the tutorial to do that. So first, open the device manager by right-clicking this PC on the desktop and choosing the manage. And then right there, on the computer management window, choose the, the device manager. So uh, as you can see here in the picture, then after that, double click onto the display adapter. And then and right click onto the integrated GPU model that your computer has to choose, disable device. Now your integrated GPU is disabled, you can now try relaunching 5M again. So I hope this video helped you and if it did, please make sure to like, subscribe, and click notification bell button so you won't miss a video. Thank you so much for watching and have a great day. Bye-bye.